Hi again. As I told you last time, uh, we're gonna write uh, something with this uh, antique style pen. And for this, we have to fill up our ink bottle, which in the set it's uh, empty. And we're gonna use uh, Pelican Brilliant Black ink and uh, just to make sure we're not gonna make here any mess we're gonna use some napkins some paper towel and let's see. Maybe will be good idea if we use uh, some uh, pipette or how it's called this thing you can take easily with but as long we don't have it we gonna pour carefully yeah as I expected I think it's uh, about uh, um, enough amount of ink if we need more later we can come fill it up more but for now it's okay so with uh, one dip they said you can write about 10 to 12 letters let's try let's try have some uh, calligraphy fun we're gonna use uh, this kind of paper with a little squares and let's try So with one dip, 10 to 12 letters, I don't know, we'll see. This is okay, but uh, if you wait uh, too much between writing, the ink is gonna get dry, so it doesn't get 10 letters. I just can make uh, for the first time two, but it's okay. Let's try with B. And to have the same uh, consistency, maybe it's a better idea to dip it uh, with each letter. Because otherwise it's going to be one a little thick and one not so thick. But like this, with uh, each dip, it's going to be the same. Yeah this is nice looks nice and it's comfortable 
to write it, but you have to have a patient. And you need to, yeah, pay, pay attention to everything because you don't want to mess, you don't want to make mess on your desk. Uh, you want to write nice also, so you have, a, you have to pay attention to all these details. D, let's make a D. I like it. E. If you want to take a break, you can leave it and then you can continue later. Let's try to change the nib. We will take it out this one. I want to see the size of the other ones we have. And we're gonna take the next, which is 1.2, I guess. 1.2. We push it, okay, just about so. Uh, sorry, I just made a little mess when I poured the ink on my fingers. So with this 1.2 uh, nip, we're gonna make uh, F. Let's see how it looks like. This doesn't work or doesn't have enough ink. Oh, so okay. Oh, nice. This is nice style. I don't know if you see the difference. And small F or Beautiful. And let's make also G with this size. Sorry, this is not a G. Yeah, here is too much ink. So the thing is you need to get used to with these uh, sizes of the nib and to know how much ink you need to have on it. 
in order to get the right letters. This also here is too much. And let's try age. Yeah, that's cool. And lowercase h hmm, beautiful when you learn how much ink you need on the nib will be a beautiful design let's change the nib we're gonna use uh, the next one, which is 1.8. Uh, personally, I um, clean uh, the nibs uh, after uh, every use because I don't wanna make a mess on my desk or anywhere else. And if you like to work clean, it's better. So the next one is 1.8. You see it's a little thick. And we're gonna make um, eye with this design. Let's try eye. Yeah, you need to dip more time uh, for the first use. I see that. Mm -hmm. One more J, one more try with J this size. Nice. And now we're gonna change the nib again. I wanna try all of them, all the sizes. And the next one needs two, 2 2.0 millimeter. Just one second to clean. And we will take the next. And with the next, we're gonna make K. That letter K. You see, you have to find a spot right here, the right spot, and push a little bit. And it goes inside. Okay, let's try. Makes, uh, making K. Let's see, this is visible, bigger. Okay. Yeah. 
yeah if you put too much you see it's gonna stuck on your blood paper blood paper and it's gonna make a mess okay this is supposed to be a K yeah the thing is you need to learn how to work with this and lowercase K Yeah, looks nice. Except the mess over there. <laughs> and L, let's try L too. Cool. We're gonna make M. Yeah, for bigger letters like M doesn't even it that is not enough even the one dip or I'm not just uh, used to it with it but we're gonna practice M oh sorry M lowercase M N O P Sorry The bigger it gets the nip it's harder gets harder because I don't have experience P Q R We're gonna change the nib. We take it the bigger one, the biggest one, which is three millimeter. I think will be very hard to work with the big one because I don't know how much ink I need. Actually, you need more in some spots and not so much in another spots. But I don't have yet the control of it. So that's why I'm making 
mess but in the same time I get experience and I have to practice in order to make perfectly just push until yes you feel the spot the right spot okay so this is the biggest the three millimeter let's see so we're gonna make s D U V W X Why? and Z. This was a nice, nice experience. I really enjoy it. I just need to practice more or yeah or to use it for the beginners my advice is to use it uh, one millimeter nip and it works better. Anyway this is a nice gift and uh, Mikhail, as he grows, uh, he learns to write. Uh, I'm sure he will want to use it because it's his gift. Uh, 
but he has time. He has time to learn. Okay, thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.